kids and sound. It often happens that some parents, usually mothers, bring their kids on a group sound meditation, or in general, they would like them to experience sound therapy. Now, I quite disagree with this kind of activities or with this kind of practice because I strongly believe that a child needs something called childhood. In childhood, obviously, parents will often, more often than not, disagree with what the kid is doing. But this is part of the evolution process. Now, what we can do as parents, or what parents can do if they really wish to introduce their kids to sound, to give them some toys in a form of a tongue drum, or, for instance, some kalimba, and in this way they will come to know about sound.